The Bending Oaks Podcast, featuring your hosts, Audrey and Zach. Production assistance provided by Tyler and Yosef. Today's podcast is produced by Douglas McNamara. Copyright 2017, Bending Oaks Incorporated. All rights reserved. Welcome to the Bending Oaks Podcast. I'm your host, Audrey. And I'm Zach. And our guest today is William. Hello. Hello. So today on this podcast, we're going to be eating Pop Rocks and some other candy. <laughs> so, nutrition that can't be beat. <laughs> okay, first question. Did you grow up here in Dallas? Yes. Mm. Nice. How long have you been going to Benny Oaks? Just started in eighth grade, so probably about four years I've been going here. Oh, wow. Yeah. Huh. Where did you go to school before? Murphy Middle School is the first school I went to before coming to Bending Oaks here. Wow. Where is that? S- somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> so I didn't really care about the schools. I didn't bother to remember its location. Mm-hmm. What made you decide to come to Bending Oaks? Well, my family had just recently moved because my parents had lost their jobs. Mm-hmm. So we decided to come here and move to my grandpa's old house. Oh. So my mom found this school on the website. She was like, oh, this is a nice school for William. You know, he can really express himself and he won't mm-hmm. be bullied or anything anymore here. Huh. So like, I was like, yeah, it sounds good. I mean, it sounded at first it sounded too good to be true. <laughs> I was like, I'll see how this goes first. Came here during the summertime and uh, everybody was visiting and stuff. I was like, you know what? It's very small, but it's very nice. Mm-hmm. All the teachers are amazing, you know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I loved it when I came here mm. and visited. Yeah, it's awesome. So, thinking back to your first day, what was it like? Did anything shock you? Oh, everything is shocked. <laughs> <laughs> back where I, when I was in school, you could not express yourself openly at all. If you if you express yourself openly, it had to be outside of school or be in detention. Mm. Mm. Mm-hmm. So like when I came here and I saw people wearing like very short shorts and like, <laughs> like very tight shirts and like like short sleeves, I was mm-hmm. like, what is going on here? <laughs> yeah, we, have, we have a lot of freedom yeah. we do. wear here. Freedom. <laughs> What's your favorite memory here? Mm. <laughs> mm, favorite memories. Too many to count. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, if you could pick one. Probably the time that Connor came, around the time Connor came here. Mm. Yeah. Because mm-hmm. I think Connor is like the first like actual friend I've actually spent that much time with ever. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So what about Connor? Like, why is that like your favorite memory? Because mm-hmm. there's so many things I could say. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alright. What's your worst memory? Um, I've never really had a bad memory since coming to Bending Oaks here. It's just so fun coming here and just waking up in the mornings, really, that I just never really like had a bad day coming to Bending Oaks. Mm-hmm. What about teachers here? How are they different from other schools? Oh, they're very open. I've never once been able to go up to a teacher and then have me like say, no, go sit back in your seat and just don't talk to me. Mm-hmm. Here, you can get up for your seat, you can go to the teachers, you can ask for help, or you can call the teachers over. And they're just very open, mm-hmm. you can call them by the first name, we have their emails and their like numbers or sometimes, mm-hmm. in case we ever need help with a subject or mm-hmm. anything. In another school, you'd never be able to get that kind of attention or anything like mm-hmm. that. So, hmm. it's one thing about this school and the teachers that I really like. Yeah. Mm, don't mind me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, some more of those. <laughs> Which one do you want? Just Which any one. Because okay, all of mine go. are fused. We have a vast selection. We do. We have a very vast mine selection. Mine are all fused to the side of the bag. <laughs> <laughs> so. Right now, I'm eating the bubble gum one that turns into gum. Gross. <laughs> <laughs> Only to bad. use that. <laughs> <laughs> it's gross. I can't complain. <laughs> Have you ever tried Pop Rocks? They're so good. I have. They aren't my favorite candy. Yeah, yeah, they can kind of hurt. Yeah, they do. They hurt my throat, so. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Blue rag. That's nice. <laughs> so, what are your plans for the future? What the fuck? Take a Pop Rock break. <laughs> mm. 
Mm. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> I, I don't want to feel left out, right so dumb dumb that is. It is the ASMR podcast. <laughs> <laughs> No, I don't like it. Oh my. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. <laughs> Back to the question, what was it again? What are your plans for the future? Oh, go to college mm-hmm. most definitely. Because, you know, I want to go to college, I want to get a degree, mm-hmm. and my favorite thing I like doing. Mm. Which I am sad that they brought back at this time of the year as well. Because <laughs> <laughs> I had suggested I wanted to do cooking. Oh. And then... Finally, after two years, they bring it back. Huh. Two years. <laughs> That's the one thing that just got me. So mm. I'm definitely gonna go to college. Mm. I'm gonna get a degree in cooking, mm. and I'm gonna hopefully find a job to where I can cook and make a lot of money. So huh. mm-hmm. you know. <laughs> what, um, what's that? <laughs> <laughs> what? mm-hmm. I was like, yeah, everyone wants to make a lot of money. Yeah. Yeah. Um, any places you might want to go for college? Mm, Richard Lynn is one of them. Mm-hmm. We had people come from different schools, but I can never remember which school it is because they all seemed amazing, but I can never remember mm. afterwards. Because mm. there was one recently that came here that talked about a school down in California, I think. Is that it? I remember one talking, or someone came and talked about. The it was a school, school that was near Austin. Mm. Oh, okay. I don't remember that one, was it? Hmm. Yeah, I was probably gonna go that one as well. Mm-hmm. Maybe. That's cool. So, as you move on, what are you gonna miss most about Penny Gubs? Uh, first, I'm gonna miss Connor because I'm gonna be mm-hmm. leaving him behind when I graduate. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna be leaving behind all the teachers that I really liked, and especially Doug, because like all the teachers and the principal here, they're really amazing. So I'm gonna miss the people here the most. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna miss its carefree and spirited attitude. There's another thing I'm gonna miss. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm just gonna miss the creativity of Bending Oaks as well. So, mm. like, we have the wall over there that's painted mm-hmm. with the flat earth. I'm gonna most mm-hmm. definitely miss that one. Mm-hmm. Yeah, of course. I see that 50% of the day. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I just stare at it, you know. Yeah. How has Bending Oaks changed you? Oh, before I came to Bending Oaks, I was very shy and reserved. Some people won't, definitely won't believe that when they see me now. <laughs> I was really shy and reserved, always like kept to myself, you know, mm-hmm. like big jacket and everything, like all just tucked inside like a little turtle. <laughs> but ever since coming to Bending Oaks, I've really opened up. I don't mm-hmm. mind people as much as I do now. Because, <laughs> well, especially this school, because all the people here are friendly. Mm-hmm. The people at a public school are just... I'm not gonna say that because it's on there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I remember uh, when I came here last year, some of the older students told me how you were like really quiet when you yeah. first came here, and I was so shocked. Like, mm-hmm. honestly, so shocked. Yeah, and you see me now. And yeah, it's I like, see you now. <laughs> you sure you're talking about that kid over there? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's one. Uh. <laughs> So if you had to sum up Bending Oaks in one word, what would it be? Amazing. Hmm. Today's podcast is flavored by Pop Rocks. Entertainment for your whole mouth. Okay. We have a round of extra questions. I'm gonna ask you. Goody. Some fun questions, if you will. Your character, or I don't know, your personality. (laughs) Okay. First question. Do you have any siblings? Yes, I have one sibling. Okay. Do you have any pets? I have multiple pets. Six cats, one dog, and... <laughs> what? Connor, yeah. Well, here's the thing. My parents and my family, we always like to take in animals that we find on take care of them because, you know, they've always been out on the streets. People have t- been taking care of them mm-hmm. and they've always been abused. So we like to take them in and mm-hmm. care for them. Oh, that's nice. And we can't really take them to a vet because eventually they'll be, like, up. Someday soon we know they'll be put down, so we'd like to keep them because we have an attachment to them. Mm-hmm. We also now have a squirrel. It's when it, we can't. It's, yes. it's illegal to own a squirrel, by the way. It's illegal to, but oh, we're not really owning it like as in a pet. We're taking care of it until you know oh, it, it okay. eventually dies. Right. Until it eventually dies. We hope it's no time soon. We right. hope it's no yeah, time soon. Yeah. Right. Right. So. What's your favorite TV show? Narcos. Huh. Mm-hmm. 
What's your favorite movie? <sighs> favorite movie, favorite movie. What was the movie we watched? Kingsman. Yeah, Kingsman. Mm -hmm. That's the one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If you could have any superpower, what would it be? Teleportation, I guess. Yeah. Mm. Teleportation. <laughs> Yosef! <laughs> Our no. last podcast no. to find out what that's about. Have you ever killed a man in self defense? I played the fifth. <laughs> I'm okay. that on All right. <laughs> Thank you for listening or watching this podcast. You can listen to us through iTunes mm -hmm. or you can watch us on our YouTube channel. Thank you so much for watching. All right. See you later. Bye. That was the best one we've had so far. Yeah, I think so. How long have that class is over? Five minutes. I'm just gonna stay.